This was brought to you by Earth. On YouTube, enhancing mobile advertising on Facebook. too if there's anything in the soil that needs to be taken up. Oh yeah and we're gonna be adding some we're gonna be adding some uh um uh, oh onions and or, no it's uh, orange orange filling to it okay and what I want to do is all through the garden this here and then I want to mix it up into the soil where it's got a good pile of orange saturate orange orange yes. orange pills and orange it will help keep the insects and mosquitoes supposedly up and out. Okay? In, you can fill it into the soil. Just fill it into the soil. It has um, don't worry when you start uh, tilling it'll go right up in there so, like I said just tap like that you don't have to worry about all that other stuff just tap Like a chopper. Oh, sorry. Okay. Point. Now you can see, I can make sure all the orange pills. And pull over. Yeah, they didn't say specifically how far apart or anything like that. They just said a quarter of an inch. Well, just to keep them. I know. I have 200 peppers. I'm going to take and take a picture of that. I don't think I did already, did I? And we're going on. It's July the 21st, 2019, and this is an update on our uh, peppers inside of the totes. And today I just wanted to take pictures and get updates on how we're looking so far it looks like we have three that grew the grass grew up in here in the last two three weeks and our weed eater plus our lawnmower ended up dying out so i'm having to go through and top everything up by hand plus make the grow beds 
I ended up clearing out this part for you so you could see the peppers that we took out of the greenhouse. Let's see how they're doing. Okay, it's July the uh, 24th, 2019 in Southern Illinois, Zone 6. I finally got this cleaned out, and here's what the peppers look like. So far, we've got 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I don't know if those are peppers, but I left them in there. I figured I would show everybody what they look like once it's been cleaned out. We got some stray cantaloupes grew up too. Decided to wrap it around the side of the toe. Came up from the ground right there. Let's see if I can get a picture of all that. All right, just wanted to keep everybody updated. Okay, it's July the 30th, 2019 uh, in Southern Illinois, Zone 6. This is an update on the peppers. So, so far, it looks like Robert got his first two peppers growing. We got one here and one here. I don't see any other ones. I see some seeds forming, which is good. So either it's three and then four. So yeah, there's four of them right there. And looks like they're turning out pretty good. Hopefully birds can get a hold of them. Take some pictures of them. Now over here we have bell peppers which are growing in this grow bed and I can show you what this looks like. We had a, a rain the other day but this is what they look like. Grab some pictures of them. And I know these aren't peppers, I'm just keeping them. There's another one over there too. I don't know why I want to keep them. I just decided I was going to do this. Yeah, there we go. They're movie stars. We did lose some of them, but we got quite a bit of the grass over root, and I had to come out in here and weed out the grass. So. I was busy doing grow beds and wasn't able to get back around to this area to keep it keep up on it. So I'll keep you updated on these peppers and let you guys see what they're how they're doing. Okay, it's August tenth, two thousand and nineteen. In Southern Illinois, Zone 6, this is an update on the peppers that we have in the boat. So far, they are doing good. Um, it's been hot, but these things have been going pretty strong. We've got one pepper growing there, another one, oh, another one growing here. Here's another one, and four, I believe it was four the last time. Out of there. Those are three stems popping up. These look like they have something that they ready to grow right there. And we lose one there too. We have two stems there. And then over here we got two more or three more stems. This one looks like something getting ready to grow there. These have uh, 
check something out here. Coming out there. And that might be another pepper. Not quite sure. But I'm keeping up on it and watching it. Um, I just wanted to update, let everybody know what's happening with the peppers here. <clears throat> I'm going to come around and show you how the bell peppers are going. The transplants that we did out of the greenhouse. After I pulled the grass, I started putting water on them too every once in a while to help keep them going because we've had no, or we've had about maybe four rains since the beginning of July, since August. So I've been putting water on them. This is what they look like. That's all I have. Keep you up there. It is September the 7th, 2019 in Southern Illinois, Zone 6. This is an update on the peppers that we have in the totes. So far, so good. Uh, we have one, two, three, four, four peppers on this one that are red. And then we have one, two, two three of them, four, five, five more growing up on top. So that plant's doing good. Or those two plants, I should say. And these are starting to bloom, and they are also getting ready or popping out uh, peppers, too. I'll try to take as many pitches as I can. This one is looking real good. So these are working out pretty good. Brought to you by Earth on YouTube, enhancing mobile advertising on Facebook. We thank you for your participation. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, share, make comments. We love feedback. <laughs>